Hello guys and welcome back to another My Team Career Mode episode. Today we're off to the Spanish Grand Prix and I really want our upgrades to be there for the Spanish Grand Prix because I think... Oh, this doesn't even come before Spain. But yeah, I really want our upgrades to push through because I think Spain is all about the chassis so... Come on, do your thing. Okay, that doesn't even come before Spain, but ooh, look at that. We're sort of in the middle now of the pack with our chassis upgrade. That's good. Hey, let's watch our upgrades fail or succeed. Uh, okay, oh, that's just a turbo upgrade. Yes, chassis upgrade. Yes, 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 okay. yes. Weather looks good for the race and oh look at that we've had some major upgrades and uh, oh <laughs> i thought we moved a little bit further up but we're still like eighth so yeah and also mclaren has moved forward with us okay it is time for quali and i'm kind of excited <laughs> <laughs> no, what are you doing, Yuki? Oh, what is this guy doing? My gosh. No. All the time you have to leave the space. Ah. Ruined our first quality run. This is my attempt to set a lap in without anybody else trying to disrupt it. Ah. <sighs> That was a messy final corner, but ooh, we're up to P10. Nice. What is this? A 122. Okay, I think we need to get in the mid 119s to be somewhere in the top 10. Well, how is Lando fastest in the middle sector? What? What did he do? 20 seconds left on the clock. So we're starting our final lap. Well, I can't speak proper. Final lap. Oh my gosh, only improved by about a 10. Ha, <laughs> be 16. <laughs> oh, great. But yeah, I was right, you need a uh, mid 119s to get into the top 10. And yeah, it just didn't improve that lap. But the good thing is that I felt like I could push the car a little bit more. And yeah, I feel a little bit competitive today. So. <laughs> We're gonna start P16 and we'll see how it goes from there. Of course, is Natalie Pinkham. Oh no. Ah! My game crashed. Oh no. Okay, so we're back. <laughs> my game just crashed. That was the first time that ever happened. But anyways, it's fine. I don't know if that was a good sign or not for the race to come, but... Oh well, let's go. Let's do this. Oh. I just noticed 
the one who do not give me space and turn one on my first quality lap is right ahead of me Yuki <laughs> I'm watching you <laughs> I used to not like this track because of the corner up ahead but now since they reprofiled it it's a little bit better um, but still sector 3 is not that great especially that horrible chicane I still don't like it but the overall having that turn reprofiled made this track a little bit better to drive in so we're gonna start P16 for our first Spanish Grand Prix and we'll see how this goes Okay, I'm, there, mate. Let's make sure we get I'm the always not centered on my out. grid slot. I need to practice being centered on my grid slot and try to be a little bit more patient. But anyways, five red lights. Slides out and away we go. Oh, tons of wheel spin. Oh, my gosh. I had to stay on the grass to avoid Daniel. Okay, P16. Okay, the final corner is where I'm always losing time. Uh, but I get pretty close to Gasly. Oh, someone's trying to make a move, Bottas. I get pretty close to Gasly through Sector 1 and the start of Sector 2. Yeah, at the end of sector 3 is just where I lose so much time oh wow my tires are almost at 100 degrees oh they are now maybe that's why I'm not really moving forward there appears to be an issue we're currently investigating oh what is that issue again boxing this lap I thought I could overtake some cars, but uh, okay, we had an issue attaching the left rear wheel. I know it's not oh. ideal. Let's try and put that behind us now and get back into this race. Oh, Bottas overtook us in the pits. Okay, we have oh, a come on, what is this? <laughs> Why? Oh my gosh. I was feeling really good about today's race. But then again, we have another issue. Ah! Yeah, and I didn't really talk much in the first stint before our pit stop because I was trying to be quicker than Gasly and unfortunately that did not work because the final chicane was just horrible because using a controller on that particular chicane is not that great you need to be very quick with the movements but anyways another DNF that's like our third now oh come on I don't know yeah I think the when the game crashed earlier that was the sign that our race was not gonna be good so we need to be reliable and have a faster car so that we can get into the top 10 please i really want to fight for the points i'm hoping for a better result in the next race so i'm gonna see you guys in the next f1 2022 video and be sure to like comment subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i will see you guys next time bye